Hello everyone, I'm Nisa Pilsen. I'm not a specialist in anything beauty related, but I like to feel pretty. I love to take princess time for myself and I really like to learn more about it. So if you want to learn along with me, then please subscribe to my channel. If you seen any of my other videos, you know I used to get eyelash extensions. However, I got allergic to the glue and then I've been hesitant to try anything new with my eyelashes. I, the last time they all fell off. All of my own natural lashes just fell off every single one. And it took a month and a half to get the lashes back I have now. So I didn't want to push anything on them. However, I tried. I've been thinking about trying magnetic lashes. But some of them are really, really expensive. So I wanted to try buy some cheap ones. And I found the cheapest. This is the Smoky Foxy Lashes. They come with one set of eyelashes and one 5 mil of magnetic eyeliner. I paid $39.95 for these lashes with the eyeliner. And I'm gonna try it. I did try them the other day just to see if how they were to have on and so on. And I'm, they were on my eyes and then just off again. So now I want to today make a wear test. Can I wear this an entire day? I'm not going out today. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just gonna be at home. Um, so so I'm gonna stop the clock. It's almost 11 o'clock. Um, and then we're gonna see how long it takes for me to be really tired of. Does it, if it, they hurt too much or they irritate of, or do, do I get an allergic reaction? I used the magnetic eyeliner uh, that came with the lashes. And if I understood correctly, I don't want the magnetic eyeliner anything where um, the product don't go on so just look at that can you see it yeah it doesn't look like a normal eye eyeliner application for me anyway um, but I'm gonna try it And I'm really gonna try to get it close to my normal lashes. But I don't want any of the magnetic eyeliner on my actual lashes because I think then they might uh, wanna stick to them in instead. Wow. It's not the hardest eyeliner to work with. Uh, I'm not perfect at, at using eyeliners I'm really not perfect at using eyeliners um, but I don't want to remove it or touch it because I, I fear that I'm only gonna make it worse um Just gonna use some mascara while they're drying, and I'm using the Lancome Hypnose mascara. I really like this for. Okay, people don't know it's so hard to put on mascara with a camera and a mirror, and I really want you to be able to see, but I really also have to be able to see it myself. I think that's what we're gonna do. I don't know how long it takes to, to dry down. This is everything that's on the back side. Um, you can read it, of course, but it's just like 
TBP Trendy Beauty Products Foxy Lashes How to use Foxy Lashes And then the full pictures Pretty idiot proof um, And then the ingredients And that's really all um, And it, I believe it's the ingredients of the liquid uh, magnetic liner because it says water as the first ingredient and I don't think that's the lashes. So I don't even know is there synthetic what what are the lashes made of? Um, but they're pretty. However, I can figure out. Normally, I would think that they're the way I supposed to wear but it thinks like this it look like they're shorter out here so maybe I should swift them around I don't want to pat my my eyeliner to figure out if the, it's set because I did that when I tried it the, the other day and it's like three hours later it's still sticky um so I think that it's magnetic but it's also a kind of a sticky glue-ish consistency um, so I'm just gonna try putting put them on and they have like it actually have six mad magnets don't know if you can see it oh you can um, it have the two out here is closer and the two out there is closer and then it have two in the middle. I'm just gonna try putting them on and it's just like I had a really hard time with it the last time because I thought that lashes went out the, all the way to the inner corner and that hurt a hell of a lot. Wow, it definitely looked like something like that. I know some people cut pieces of them, however, I, I think that if I cut some of this, then I would cut too much because it's only a small part out here that's too big. I think it's hard to get the inner corner sticking. I think it's kind of like that. And then I was told I could use this to push them together. If I can get it all the way to. <laughs> that hit didn't help at all. Get in there. Wow. <laughs> yeah. This eye look definitely isn't big enough for these eyelashes, but we work with what we got. Sorry if you can hear something, it's my cat and he's really angry at me because he got hurt so he can go outside before his leg, leg uh, heals up and he really wants to go outside but he can't walk normally so I don't want him to so he's really mad at me and he does anything to irritate me right now. Please someone, if they know a trick to do this a lot easier, tell me. Please tell me. But tell me in a nice way. Don't tell me I'm stupid for doing this. I never ha I never tried fake lashes. I, I woke up, I, I grew up as a dancer, but because I had 
real thick black eyelashes and never use them. I tried the other day with a pin set, but then it just stuck to the pin set. I don't know, is it a pin set in English? Please tell me. Wow. I'm pretty sure if I want to keep using fake eyelashes, I should buy something better because it's like um, the part where the hairs is sticking out, it's really stiff, it won't uh, work around my eyes yet, it's like if when I try to put it down here, it pops up here. And if I try to put it down there, it puts up there. So I think that's like as good as it can be for now. So um, yeah, we're gonna work with this. I'm gonna check in with you later uh, in a few hours, and then we're gonna see if I'm if they made me cra crazy or. If they're okay if I get used to it right now I feel like when I look, close my eyes I can feel something um, pricking not inside my eye but in, in in here that way and I but I feel like they they're gonna stick there they're gonna stay and I actually only use one I only applied the eyeliner once. I know that some people uh, have said that you always have to apply two coats, but I think it's on there. You see, this really isn't that pretty, but it won't go back. So this is what we're gonna work with. Let me know what you think and let me know if you have tried this. Boxy lashes. Um, I actually think they're pretty for the price. Like I, I looked at 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 lashes in like a thousand Danish crowns and and five hundred and in that price range. And for what's it worth, like thirty nine point ninety five. Um, I actually think they're pretty. Um, can I wear them a whole day? We are gonna find that out. See you later. Hello everyone. I just want to check in. in and as you can see, it's still trying to jump off in here. It's okay, I think, out here. It's only this tiny bit which normally would be cut off. So that's okay. But in here... You can see when I do like this, especially over here, that's not, not okay. So if you want to wear these for a whole day, you need to be able to be close to a mirror so you can fix them again and again and again during the day. Again, they were extremely cheap i don't think you can find anything cheaper than this um so i think it's okay they don't hurt anymore i thought in the beginning they were in the first 30 minutes it's they were really irritating to have on and um, but now it's just like it's only when i look in the mirror actually i just oh right i have them on um, I've just been sitting here working on my computer and I, I think they do a good job for that. <laughs> no one's it's, it's going to see me when I'm sitting here so that's okay. I'm gonna keep them on a few more hours and see if there's any difference. Um, I wouldn't wear them as they are now to a party or something like that because I think when I dance and I sweat and everything, you know, my hair stri might strike them. I think if I do like this, then you can see 
it's my hair is enough to pull them um but i'm gonna let them sit a few more hours and then we're gonna see so it's 7 30 in the evening and i've been wearing these glasses for eight and a half hour and they, they, they feel nice I, I actually still don't feel them at all I did however try three hours ago to pick them a little off halfway off and add some extra um, a magnetic eyeliner to see if that would help but I did then I put them on again and I think five minutes later it's just like poof this and I actually th think it's because they are made for eyes uh, less round than me more flat because uh, when I take them off they don't hurt to get off. Oh, here you can see here. There, my eyes a lot is a lot more round than this, and they're really stiff. So I think that might have something to do with it. So I think it would work a lot better of another eye shape. You can also see here this eyeliner you can't use it as an eyeliner because look how awful it is and when the eyelash popped up you can see it smudged the eyeliner it pulled the eyeliner with it and it also pulls some eyeliner with it off here you can see that and I was told that I sh could clean them but not with regular regular I could I was told I could clean I was told I could clean them with um, makeup remover or something like that and it had to be without oil um, so someone told me it could be micellar water and i never use my micellar water at all but um i bought a i bought a tiny flash flask of it and you can see it for life like that um and i'm just gonna put it on a what this called in english like cotton pin Something like that. Please tell me in the comments below if you know what it's called. So I'm just, I think I'm just going to do like this. So it's get wet. And then just like, oh, it's so sticky. And then just. And I will see if I, when I saw someone else do this on YouTube, it looked so easy. Like it was just falling off and nothing happens I can see you can see it I, but I can see eyeliner stuck on the magnet here and on the lashes here and it don't want to come off it doesn't make any difference well it you see the tiny bit of blackness <laughs> that that came off but this gonna take a hell of a long time so I'm keep working on this and then I gonna tell you if it worked because I think maybe if I <laughs> use a half an hour on this so I'm gonna tell you in a bit
Hey everyone, I was just editing this video and I noticed I forgot to film the last part. Um, but here, here it is. They were awful to clean. They were okay to wear out beside the point that they do didn't want to stay on. I won't recommend them. I will really recommend some lashes I have tried since and that video is going to come up soon so if you want to see that or just you want to see more from me please subscribe and if you like this video don't be afraid to share it below you can also follow me on instagram where i put this pretty pretty face up a lot and you can see more pictures of my cats i really hope you want to see me again i definitely want to see you again have a good day bye